everybody, Catfish Jones here on January 3rd for the CFJ Vlog. It is another week, and I hope yours is going well. Another short week if you were lucky enough to get some vacation time the extra day for Monday, which I was, but I also have some extra, extra time that I'm taking this week for my vlogcation, and I'm trying to do daily vlogs on those vlogcation days, on days that I would be working, I'm going to do a vlog. Um... But there's also weekend content that I do regularly anyway, so it's very likely that for the, the next couple of weeks you'll see daily content from this channel, um, which I think I did somewhat, I did every other day in October, for Vlogtober, and uh, that was quite an a, a interesting journey. At first it was very daunting, but by the end of it it was like, well, I could just kind of keep making some cool stuff. So I've been making some cool stuff idea-wise and testing some of the content that, that hasn't quite turned out ready for presentation, but needs must when the devil drives, and this week I may be putting out some of that uh, shakier content, a little more cash, but it'll be alright, there's a lot of fun stuff going on, I'm doing a lot of fun stuff, since I decided to stay local for my vlogcation and not travel halfway across the country, um, I figure it would be fun to do some different things than I normally do. Although, it seems like my current vlogs tend to be either in the mad science lab or up here in the parlor, and I'd like to find a different location. I was hoping to find a different location for today, but I also had to be aware of my stress level. It's no fun to take vacation days and then stress out over what you're going to do for the vlogcation videos. So, <sighs> under advice from some very good friends in the comment section of yesterday's vlogcation video, I'm going to take it a little more easy. I've got a, a lot more resting planned than uh, my calendar initially had. I do have a painting over here you might not have seen before. This is one that hangs regularly in our dining room, um, and an old one of mine, one of the limbs studies couple different styles of limb studies I do, and this is one where the the limbs in it, you know, as, as they cross and as the eye sees it cross, sometimes you see the edges kind of blend together and circularize, and sometimes as they jig and jag, you see kind of some of these little lattice works kind of, I don't know, kind of move a little bit. It's not a perfect straight edge. It wasn't, you know, made by Frank Lloyd Wright. Um, so I wanted to represent some of that in that painting. It's a very old, old painting. Um, and at that time, I was trying to be clever and paint on the back side of pre-bought stretched canvas. This is one where the normal uh, brace right down the middle I wanted to offset to kind of, I don't know, support the idea of this limbs study. It's been one of my favorite paintings for a long time, and I really wanted to share it with you guys. Um, the logistics of hanging a painting backwards, very similar to hanging a wood painting, a slab of wood, uh, which some of you may have received in the past year and may receive this year from one of our fellow YouTubers. It's a good painting. It's a good place to share it. It fits this room very well, although next week we'll likely see the player again, the, the green abstract self-portrait I love so much which does fit this room. It fits the couches and and everything else. Um, but yeah, this is the, the, the parlor vlog, Catfish Jones. I've been doing a lot of fun stuff. Some of the things, I think today, on the vlogcation video, you're going to see some of the fun stuff I have planned for you. And just, just a little, little drop in the bucket, a little something extra going on here. Um, but let me... Uh, let me segue right into the song part of it, because I've been thinking about this one for a while. Um, because it's been pretty cold. I don't know where you're at geographically. Maybe it's not so cold. Uh, dude behind the camera and band in New Zealand might not be so cold. Looks like they're having summer with short sleeves and short pants. I gotta say I'm a little jealous. Australia, New Zealand, that side of the continent. Uh, the con uh, world. It's a world. <laughs> that side of the world having some summertime right now and I could go for it. Instead, I'm writing songs. It's actually a Gunther Skunk song, which means it's an alternate persona. 
uh, do some stuff that I don't know that Catfish Jones could really get away with. This one specifically is a bit of an angry song. Very angry. Mostly just angry because it's cold. You ever been so cold you're just mad at the cold? So let me try this song here. A little bit of a rocker. I wanted to do it on electric, but I thought it would be best to do it acoustic up here in the parlor with a fun painting. And... Uh, We'll, we'll see how it goes from here. Uh, I had to, before I get into it, I did have to remember how to play this because it had been a year or more. Um, I don't know if you're familiar with my Gunther Skunk alternate persona, but I had the second record, I really gave myself a three month limit to write and record a 15 song record from scratch, which means I couldn't drag in old material and I couldn't do anything like that. So this is one I really had to force write. Not forced right, because it doesn't really seem forced on a lot of that. A lot of it was like, well, I need another song. Where's the unicorn bucket at? You grab your bucket and start swooping around till you capture unicorns. You're like, ah, okay, these are the songs I can make right now. Um, and these are the songs I was able to make. So that song is, or that album is called Misbegotten Noises. And from Misbegotten Noises, you know what? Let me scratch that, because this one is actually even older. Misbegotten Noises was the one that I made a project for myself, and this was not actually on that. This is earlier, maybe aught nine, maybe 2010, something like that. Maybe even as late as 11 or 12. Uh, when I made the Gunther Skunk persona, it was, you know, breaking into places Catfish Jones hadn't been before. And the first record was called Disco Plasmosis, and uh, it's a fun one. On the Bandcamp, if you go to guntherskunk.bandcamp.com, You'll be able to find these, and I'll try to remember to link it below. This is one that I really enjoy, although I didn't I didn't sing the best on it. It wasn't that great of an... Specifically the ending. I'm very disappointed with the ending, but we'll see how it goes. As it is, this song is called North Wind. A little angry about being so very cold. <laughs> So that's North Wind. 
a little lower with the G skunk I was trying to sing pretty low and I love that range I love crooning in that love just ah, it's a great thing it's a great fun side venture I've got a whole nother record that's already made in the head and some scratch already written down on the notepad I'd love to make that but an alternate persona requires supplemental energy when you're done doing the stuff you need to do you can then go to some of those other projects unless that alternate persona is there to facilitate learning and getting better so that you can do the real stuff better and those first two stabs at Gunther Skunk I'll probably put CDs out of them because upon listening to them with Mississippi Fuzz in fact he really loved that little lick on here that uh So we had fun jamming that both Thursday and Sunday at band practice. We just, whoa, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, Normal Reaction does this at one of our next shows. Um, North Wind, Gunther Skunk. It's a fun one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It is bitter cold out there, so it couldn't be more fitting. Um, had a fun painting, which likewise does not have any leaves. How is that likewise? Okay, mouth is rambling. Vlog is close to ending. We can tell I need to stop. So right here, I'm going to call it Catfish Jones on the CFJ vlog. Thank you for watching this whole thing. Creeping up on 12 minutes. You guys have been stupendous and awesome. And I will look for you guys. You guys see the dead clock back here? Notice it's always pointing at the same time. And nice shot of this video and some of our Buddhas. You guys enjoy yourself. Look for some very fun content from Catfish Jones for this vlogcation. And for the 3rd of January on the CFJ vlog, this has been it. I can't take it back. Cheers.